back to another video it is monday september 6th and today i want to talk about a project that i think is really just creating their own sort of lane in the cryptocurrency blockchain space and today i want to talk about taboo token so i just want to quickly go over what taboo token is what they do what they have planned give my opinion on this project and then get your guys's opinions in the comments below let's not waste any time you guys let's just get right into it so taboo token you guys is an adult nft and streaming media project it's specializing in highly exclusive content with models who aren't strictly just porn stars their content is nothing like ad other adult tokens taboo does aim essentially to be the playboy of blockchain their marketplace is cutting edge and is built by the engine coin marketplace developers now right off the bat for me personally i think this is just something that can be extremely extremely interesting moving forward and again something that i haven't really seen before i know that there obviously is other i guess adult considered adult tokens on the market right now but i think taboo is really taking and trying to separate themselves um you know in compared to those other adult tokens because they're using models and it's not directly tied to you know xxx content or anything like that so what taboo is essentially trying to do here is become the playboy of blockchain and many people consider playboy to be you know the higher class of that industry or the classier just more prestige um you know version in that industry so what that's really what taboo token is trying to do here and there is really a lot of things to like with this project so Again, their purpose that you can see here, um, pretty lengthy description here of the purpose. So I just will kind of skim through it. But Taboo, at, at Taboo, essentially nothing is forbidden. They promote personal empowerment, inspiring their participants to be confident, happy, and excited to explore their Taboo fantasies and heart desires. To achieve this goal, they aim to innovate the world of media through quality over quantity. Now, I think that is something that I think Playboy will really implement it and try to do is quality over quantity. And like they say here, the aim is not only to provide content, but industry innovation by using blockchain technology to the greatest profit potential for creators, coupled with the most exciting environment for consumers. Taboo provides the highest quality exclusive SFW, NSFW, and to XXX exclusive media from content creators. All Taboo and preferences are welcome. So they are not um, restricting Taboo platform to any sort of preference. Right. They also have their NFT marketplace and it's essentially the NFT marketplace and their media platform will be cross chain and it will utilize the layer two solution protocols with the absolute lowest fees and faster transactions. There will also be an asset bridge that will be built along with the version one of the marketplace to bring the ER7 ERC721 and the ERC1155 compatible NFTs to the taboo ecosystem that does in fact run on the Binance Smart Chain. Their marketplace will also be built on a cross-chain compatible platform targeting networks like Polygon, Harmony, and Phantom. Um, if you're familiar with any of those networks, you know how strong in the massive support that both Polygon, and Harmony, and Phantom have. They will also have a merchandise store where you can buy your favorite goodies, which I think personally is something that is much, much needed in the creation of a long-term project. And they also have a unique forum that will be made as well with special incentives and rewards for generating traffic. But nonetheless, obviously in the adult industry, you know, they do say anyone with a camera can create that sort of media, but their NFT marketplace tier system aims to create scarcity in an oversaturated market. Now, when I first kind of heard about this project, that's something what I kind of immediately thought about was that this market can be somewhat oversaturated, but this is where, again, I think Taboo Token really separates themselves. So the more Taboo Tokens essentially a person holds, the more content they can access similar to buying a diamond tier on patreon or any sort of you know pay to receive access website each tier will grant access to more and more content with the highest quality and most exclusive content contained at the highest tier for the most discerning consumers right so just off the bat the tier system that i think they are creating super super cool and something that i think will allow the exclusive and i guess rare content um you know from the highest quality supermodels or content creators is going to really be the name of the game for taboo now as far as the specifics on uh other things like that they do have a 30k audit that is currently in process as well 
Um, the white bit exchange, which is actually going to be the third exchange, is going or actually went live for trading two days ago. They have Hollywood billboards as well. If we take a look here at the Taboo Token Medium, you can see that the Hollywood billboards are in fact live. Um, you know, this this billboard is live in Hollywood. Um, so it just goes to show you the legitimacy and the seriousness that um, the developers here at Taboo Token are taking in their project and with their advertisement. You can see this weekly update from August 22nd to August 29th, so just a week ago. You can see, again, as if last week wasn't exciting enough, there was an AMA with James and Majid on August 24th, 2021. You can check it out on their YouTube. Again, they do have a YouTube channel as well, which I will link All in right. the description below to the direct YouTube channel. But going back to the medium, we, they hit a whopping $14 million market cap. They launched their billboard for Taboo above Hollywood Billboard in Los Angeles, which, you know, obviously many people would agree, the hub of the adult industry. They announced their newest model, Brianna Teresi, or TC, who is very, very popular on Instagram. They also trended once more on CMC coin market cap, which I think, you know, to even get the coin market cap listing, very, very important to me um, when I'm looking to become a holder of a project. And then also, I did want to mention that down here below, the biggest announcement of all, we listed our token on Whitebit, which I did exchange, went live for trading yesterday. Okay, so they have numerous partners as well, um, you know, that they are working with and even more partners that they do plan to be working with um, in the future. I, I just some names to you know if you are familiar with some of these names like Holly Barker, CJ Sparks, Koloe, Tere, Jenny Summers, and there are apparently a lot, lot more models on the way that are going to be working directly with Taboo, you guys. So I just think right off the bat, also when taking a look at their Twitter, um, and I, I do take Twitter somewhat serious in when I'm looking to become a potential holder of the project, I do like how often they are updating their followers. Um, you know, are their supporters or holders on what's going on at Taboo. Also, I do want to mention that um, they do actually kind of go beyond just the NFTs. Obviously, like I said, they have the unique tiering system. But if you take a look if the Taboo token and we take a look here at the white paper, which again, another important factor to look at when become, becoming a potential holder of a project, um, if you take a look at the white paper and we come down here to the tiering system, which I had mentioned, and again, I look at many, many white papers like all the time and Taboo, their white paper is extremely, extremely well done, extremely descriptive. They did not jump any steps in making this project. And I just think in the long run, that is very, very important and will you know create that longevity that we all want in a holding a specific project. But you can just see, I mean, just looking at the white paper, the different types of things that Taboo has going on and intends to have going on, virtual reality functionality, Taboo magazine and e-zine, radio show, like I said, they're trying to be the playboy of blockchain. So obviously a Taboo magazine fits right into those plans. Social engagements, they will be hosting parties at their very own Taboo mansion. There are several designated and chosen locations, but the team has decided to keep this a secret until the time is ripe. Obviously, with COVID-19, they understand that. But again, parties like that, social engagements, a magazine, radio show, things that are definitely going to create value for Taboo Token in the long run and definitely something that I think is going to separate themselves from other adult tokens. But like I said, the tier system is what really is intriguing me as a potential holder. So like I said, each tier will have the ability for content creators to sell their content either a la carte or as part of a subscription service price per tier to allow for flexible pricing for both users and content tier creators. So obviously, if you're, if you're watching this and you're familiar with like OnlyFans or other websites like this, this is definitely somewhat similar to that with the tiers, but the more taboo tokens you're holding, the more access you have to specific content, right? So there's no holding requirement specifically. Um, essentially, these grants access to free teaser materials or of higher tiers, as well as certain types of content. Each content creator has decided to place here the SFW tier, Ludes, Lingerie, Cosplay, and other anything else our content creators desire. And then obviously it gets more and more, I guess, 
open or you have access to more and more content as those tiers do get larger. There is, however, a 10% fee on every transaction and a minimum of 1,000 in taboo held in every user's wallet or staked on the platform grants access to NSW, NSFW content level. And this would be what you can see here, so on and so forth. So I definitely think the tiering system is something that really, really, again, separating themselves, separating taboo token from other adult projects. And they just have many, many things on the way. And again, I think the engine marketplace developers that are making their marketplace is going to be live in a number of weeks for version one, like I said, and that is just another thing to extremely look forward to. So again, you guys, let me know in the comments below how you guys happen to feel um, about Taboo Token. Also, I did want to mention there is an article on News BTC on Taboo Token that is very, very detailed and can really explain in you know article form about the significance of this project Taboo, a popular NFT and media streaming project. You guys definitely think it's one to take a look at. Again, I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. But like I said, like Taboo says, they are bringing quality, innovation, and exclusivity to the NFT market. And again, I do think they're definitely separating themselves. So let me know in the comments below how you guys feel about Taboo Token. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. Drop a like on this video. And as always, you guys have a great day.